So, a couple days ago, I got scammed out of about 1.6 million. That's my graph, and as you can see, it was doing pretty good. Uh, I wasn't actively trading. I programmed the sniper that got me a bunch of really good deals. That's why it goes up and down and stuff, because I buy a bunch of projectors and stuff. Anyway, I'll briefly explain what had happened. I don't want this video to be very long. So, some dude with an anime profile picture had DM'd me and was like, Sup, want to offer on my Vesp? Uh, I sent him a trade calculator of a lowball because I didn't care about his item and I don't really like the trade and I didn't want Vesp. He was like, hell no, Saba emoji. what else you got? I responded with a screenshot of my inventory. He's like, yeah, let's do a mass. Eventually, we had came to the agreement that I would give him my projecteds and my smalls for his Vesp. Obviously, this was a this was a deal I wanted. Uh, I got excited. I was going to get rid of all my garbage and finally get a big item. I've I'd never had anything like that. Uh, the biggest item I've had is Noctis, which is rare. So, no one outside the trading community even knows what it is. Um, obviously. This random did not trust me, he just met me, so he started going on about using a middleman and asked me if I wanted to pick one. I told him I didn't trust middlemen because uh, I'd been scammed by one before out of like a hundred thousand. My friend had tricked me into using his friend as a middleman. Uh, that stunk, but this is definitely worse. Uh, I say we don't have to do the trade if he's uncomfortable with trusting me, uh, and I don't trust middlemen. He goes, well, it won't hurt to look, so I go along with it, because he does have a point. It doesn't hurt to, to check it out. And then I respond with, uh, I don't want to do this trade right now. My friend is sleeping, and I usually get advice on bigger trades from him, because he's more used to big items than I am. I've always just traded smalls if I traded at all. He pressures me into getting into the deal a bit more by saying, Man, I've had this vest for so long, I don't want to wait until tomorrow. So, I ask him what his username is, he tells me what it is. I see he's owned it for like five months. So, I could understand that he doesn't want it anymore. You do get bored of big items after you've had them for a little while. Uh, he invites me to a server with like 25,000 people. Uh, I join it. It's got a bunch of vouchers every day of the week for weeks. This server looks legitimate. Uh, yeah. I can't believe it was fake. I'm still in a state of disbelief. I just can't believe it. We have our own little channel. Uh... It's named, like, Ticket 3600 and something. I don't know. It was it was a big number like that, though. The Miniman talks about uh, how this is going to go down, and the other guy processes payment and all that. Uh, I start transferring my smalls over to the middleman, and after a couple of hours of accepting the trades that he's sending me because of the new restrictions on trades per account and stuff like that uh, the guy who offered me Vesp has decided he does not want this deal anymore he has decided that his friend said it is not worth for him so after I didn't get advice from my friend he goes ahead gets advice from his friend he wants to drop the entire thing <clears throat> uh, the middleman is pissed He's like, how could you do this to us? We just spent hours transferring monkeys' smalls over to my alt. He's been sitting there accepting the trades. I've been sitting there sending them. And then he's like, oh, man, guys, I'm just so sorry. I can't do this anymore. I got to keep my Vesp. And so I am very upset with this. I just kind of sit there for probably... 15 minutes and out of nowhere the middleman steps in is like monkey I'll tell you what I've got a Dominus Rex on my storage account nobody can afford it it's 
it would be worth for me to downgrade it into smaller items that I could sell instead. Uh, if you include some of your not for trade items, I could I could give you my Rex. So now I'm thinking, all right, I can get something out of this after all. So yeah, this dude seemed really legit, like 25,000 people vouches. I even asked randoms in Raleigh Mons if this was a good server. I asked like four people. They all said, oh yeah, that's the real one. Go for it, dude. So he sends me a couple more trades. Uh, I accept them. These are the big trades. Like, I hadn't... I gave... Well, I guess I did give like 800k already, but... I gave another... Uh, however much more, I don't know. Um, after I accepted the last couple trades, he bans me from the server. Says, oh man, I'm so sorry, I hope you get a rollback. So, the message of this video is, try to spread awareness. I don't really want this to happen to anyone else. It's terrible. Big servers can scam too.